promises to be the most historic in WWE history. Welcome to Boston, Massachusetts. Welcome to TLC. Tonight, the authority is showing Mr. 9 to 5 who is the boss. John Cena guaranteed his rematch. That rematch will happen tonight for the United States Championship contested in a tables, ladders, and chairs match where anything can happen. And then after this, Mr. 9 to 5, whether he wins or loses, goes on to battle. One on one, the big dog, Roman Reigns. Will Mr. 9 to 5 come out on top tonight? Let's find out. Lillian Garcia, take it away. We can't hear you, nor do we want to hear you. Ladies and gentlemen, this contest is scheduled for the United States Championship and will be contested in a tables, ladders, and chairs. And there he is, ladies and gentlemen, right in his own backyard, John Cena. The man who's run the WWE for the last 13 years. Goes one on one against what might possibly be his gravest challenge. Broken nine to five. Broken 9-5, to five, defeated John Cena at the Survivor Series to attain his first major title on the WWE main roster. And John Cena is looking to take that title back tonight at tables, ladders, and chairs. Live from Boston, Massachusetts, and the authority has stacked the deck against Mr. 9-5. Unlike anything I've ever seen this company do. John Cena and Roman Reigns in the same night, back to back. Doesn't spell good for Mr. 9 to 5. And there he is, the champion. Mr. 9 to 5, look at the disrespect, ladies and gentlemen, as he drags the championship that represents the United States of America. Look at how he drags it down the aisle. Almost as if it's a sign of disrespect to John Cena, who is not afraid to show his patriotism his love for America Mr. 9 to 5 ready to fight and he's ready to defend this highly sought after United States Championship this will be his first TLC match this will be the first TLC match that you guys are seeing right here on WWE 2K17, my career. That's what it's all about, ladies and gentlemen. The United States Championship. Cena is ready. 9 to 5 is more than ready. Here we go. The bell is rung. And this TLC match is on the way. And Mr. 9 to 5 with that jumping lariat. Beautifully done to take Cena off the off the mat. Followed up by a neckbreaker. Vicious neckbreaker by Broken 9 to 5. Cena's on his back. Early on in this match, those X Wall Street esque leg drops. He ain't with Wall Street anymore, ladies and gentlemen. This man is of another world, seeking unearthly beings. The seven deities have granted him the United States Championship. 
and it will be the seven deities who will say to Mr. 9-5, to five, you have run your course as United States Champion. It is now time to attain the WWE Championship. And look at this, Mr. 9-5 to five took out a secondary ladder, goes for that ladder, he missed, and now John Cena's making a pay. Crushing the kneecaps. A broken 9-5, to five. oh my God, Cena with that ladder. Not about rolling out of the way. Look at that. He can't even get up. John Cena. Finally. Finally. The attack with that ladder has stopped. Not to fight with that big vertical suplex. On the outside. He's going for that neck breaker again. Those might be pads, ladies and gentlemen, but. That hurts. And nine to five with another jumping lariat. Cena is down again. Nine to five now just laying on the offense here at TLC. And now nine to five's got that ladder. He's doing damage with that ladder. John Cena rolls out of the way. This crowd. This crowd with the dueling chance. One of the most polarizing figures in all of WWE is John Cena. Now John Cena with that ladder again. 9 to 5, look at this. Wrestles that ladder away from him. Right in front of us here, look at that great camera work by <laughs> Kevin Day. And look at that, Mr. 9 to 5. Knocks that ladder out of his hands. Death Valley driver. Down! John Cena's in trouble. John Cena is in trouble here. TLC for the United States Championship. And out to throwing that ladder in the ring. He might have visions of ascending the heights. He's looking to get back in the ring. Any opportunity he sees Cena down, he's got to take it. Not to five with another Death Valley driver. Coming up. Down. Nine to five now going for that ladder. Looking to set up the ladder in the center of the ring and Cena is getting back to a vertical base rather quickly. German suplex by Broken, nine to five. Nicely done to momentarily take out Cena. And nine to five now, climbing the ladder. And this is the first ladder match that we will be seeing in my career. So obviously there's gotta be a tutorial to go over anything, but I got it. I know what to do. There we go, ladies and gentlemen. Look at this, Mr. 9 to 5, looking again. That, look at that. It, look at that, Cena caught him. Power bomb right on the tip of that ladder. Cena, pro Cena chance here. From the TD Garden in Boston, Massachusetts, another German suplex. Nicely done by Broken 9 to 5. Uh oh. Go for that tombstone. Go for that tombstone. Cena blocked it. Counted it into a single arm DDT. It's 9 to 5. Go for that neck breaker, but follows up with that huge lariat. We are live from Boston, Massachusetts. And Cena goes right into that ladder. Face first. Pro Cena here. Mr. 9 to 5, one of the most hated men in all of WWE. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, Cena's setting up. Cena's setting up for the AA. Cena's setting up for the AA, Mr. 9 to 5, look at this. Counters it. Big DDT. Beautiful move. By Broken 9 to 5. Butterfly Suplex coming up. Perfectly executed by the Broken One. And Mr. 9 to 5 now going for that ladder yet again. Cena is down. He's got to take full advantage of Cena with his back on the mat. Cena is looking to make a move here. Cena is looking to make a move here. 9 to 5. Sees it. And John Cena with some lefts and some rights. Throws nine to five on that middle turnbuckle, on that middle rope. Rolls out of the way. 
Nine to five counters with a right at a European uppercut. Nice wherewithal by Mr. Nine to five, but seen with that deep arm drag. Nine to five block, left, right to the jaw, and a right. Blake Lariat takes Cena down. Mr. 9 to 5 might be looking for his finishing move, the blessing of the gods. Will he be able to nail it? I don't know, but he's going for a tombstone here. Tombstone pile driver on Cena, and he busts him open. 9 to 5 rushes up the ladder. The United States Championship hangs in the balance. Cena climbing up. We have a duel for the ladder. And the United States Championship. Who will take control of this ladder? Knife edge shot. Look at those karate -ass kicks. Cena dazed. Cena falls. Nine to five needs to hang on just a little bit longer. And he will pull off one of the biggest upsets in WWE. He's looking to grab it. Can he unhook it? Can he unhook it? He's almost there. Does he got it? to five literally and figuratively has ascended the heights of world wrestling entertainment defeats John Cena for the United States title and step one to making this the most historic night of all time In a feud that has seen jealousy. In a feud that has seen two men fighting for superiority on Monday Night Raw. It all comes to a volcanic eruption tonight at TLC. Mr. 9 to 5 literally has no break in between. Triple H has booked this match. Not by coincidence, back to back. Roman Reigns looking at his fist, setting him up for that Superman punch. Tonight here at TLC, the Roman Empire. Looking to bring Mr. 9 to 5's world crumbling down. This will be a non-title affair for the United States Championship. This is simply booked as a grudge match between Reigns and 9 to 5. 9 to 5 will have no rest. 9 to 5 will have absolutely no chance at regaining any strength, at regaining any energy. He is coming into this a tired man. While uh, Roman Reigns is coming into this match, fresh as a daisy. The TD Garden here in Boston, Massachusetts, showering this man with much deserved booze. Roman Reigns, one of the most disliked, polarizing figures in all of WWE, and rightfully so. When the people don't want something, they don't want something. They'll let you know who and what they want. It's up to the WWE to listen. Do they? Of course not. Roman Reigns is ready, and he's ready for a fight. Here's the 9 to 5 now being introduced. 
walking down to the ring as if nothing even happened with Lana. We see Lana now. She was not by ringside during the tables, ladders, and chairs match with John Cena. She is here right now, though. Mr. 9 to 5 needed Lana to heal his wounds after the ladder match with John Cena, and I think she did a commendable job. That's why Mr. 9 to 5 hired her. This man is the most dominating force right now in all of WWE. And that United States Championship is his prize, is his trophy. The WWE Universe is in for a treat here, ladies and gentlemen. What a night to start TLC off. Can 9 to 5 make this the most historic night in WWE? history. We're going to find out right now. Look at 9 to 5's health. He's got nothing. And he's going against a fresh Roman Reigns. And Roman Reigns starts it off with a big backbreaker. Mr. 9 to 5. Look at this. Lana knows. Lana knows. Arguing with Reigns. Trying to give 9 to 5 the advantage. And look at how slow he is to get to his feet. After that backbreaker, Roman with a big belly to belly suplex. Wow, look at that left. Right to the jaw. 9 to 5. Look at this. Reverses that gut wrench suplex. Pushes Reigns right into the corner. And shoves him right into the steel. Hits that steel post. Fells up on that knee. Can 9 to 5 pull off this upset? Death Valley. Driver. Down. Look at this. Those quick, swift, agile leg drops. It's the 9 to 5 now. Doubling up on his offense, it looks like. Yes, it is. Four leg drops right across the throat and the sternum of Roman Reigns. Misses that drop kick. Reigns had that one well scouted. And 9 to 5's in the corner now. In a precarious position. Reigns off the top! Superplex down! He's going for the cover! And not even a one count. On broken nine to five. Reigns working on that shoulder area, working on that trapezius area. Nine to five gets back to a vertical base. Counters with a jawbreak. Uh-oh! Uh-oh! Sit out! Power bomb! And Lana throws in a chair! Chairs are not legal! That huge forearm! Look at the power! Look at the power! Gut wrench suplex! From the grounded position, and now Lana looking to check on the turnbuckle! Lana might have cost 9 to 5 there. She's doing everything in her power to make sure 9 to 5 gets a victory here tonight. Roman Reigns is in trouble. That big knee right to the gut. Can 9 to 5 build up enough momentum to take down the Roman Empire after already wrestling one match here tonight? Certainly doing a commendable job. Reigns is going for the cover here. Wow, look at that. Not even a one count. Not even a one count. Can he get unbroken 9 to 5 after all he's been through tonight? Ladder match with John Cena. And now this Pier 6 brawl with Roman Reigns. Uppercut. Lariat. Kip up. Who and what can stop Mr. 9 to 5? At this point, I don't think anything. I don't think anything. And now he's setting up Reigns. He's about to give Reigns a blessing. Look at this creepy motherfucker. Mr. 9 to 5 sets him up. The kiss of death seals a victory. The blessing of the gods. He's going for the cover. 
One, two, wow! History has been made! Mr. 9 to 5 tonight proved he is the greatest! of all time! And just like that, the Roman Empire comes tumbling down. Wow, look at this, ladies and gentlemen. Roman Reigns. Staring a hole right through 9 to 5. This is not over at all. Heading into Monday Night Raw. Coming off one of the most historic... Nights of all time! We are live from Bloomington, Illinois! And Mr. 9 to 5 is going to address the WWE Universe. What is on his mind right now? as he just took down Roman Reigns and John Cena in the same night. He joins the league of Chris Jericho, who defeated Stone Cold Steve Austin and Dwayne The Rock Johnson to become the first ever undisputed world heavyweight champion. Let's see what the broken one has to say here tonight. You all know what I'm about. I'm about winning, plain and simple. I'm about going out there, giving 110% and walking away with the victory. And tonight, someone out there is going to learn that first hand. I don't have to prove I'm the greatest of all time. I don't have to prove anything to anyone. It's as readily apparent as the immaculate nose on my devastatingly handsome face. Someone though seems to disagree and I'd like to call him out here to let him state his case. It's time for me to put this guy in his place once and for all. Seth Rollins! I'm inviting you to the ring for a little public deletion. You can finally understand your inferiority. Mr. 9 to 5 is calling out the WWE Champion. Oh my God. Mr. 9 to 5 thinks he deserves a shot at the WWE Championship. After the performance he put on at TLC, can you blame him? Seth Rollins actually is out here confronting the broken one. Hey, I was perfectly happy sitting back there in my dressing room with everyone waiting on me. But I was so amused with what he was saying, I thought I'd come out here and have some fun. It's going to be more fun handing you your teeth. Seth Rollins already throwing threats at Mr. 9 to 5.
there are two types of people in this world, Rollins. The kings and the peasants. And you never interrupt a king. Big mistake. So I'll give you a few seconds to correct yourself and walk back where you came from. Here's the ninth five now turning the tables on Seth Rollins. Wow. You really know a lot of big words there, nine to five, don't you? Good for you. Did your mommy buy you a dictionary for your birthday? Well, why don't you pull it out and look up the word loser? I think you might find your picture right next to it. Mr. 9 to 5 does not look pleased at that childish insult by Seth Rollins. Listen, I know you're trying to sound like a smart guy here, Rollins. And I'll make sure the authority gives you a sticker, okay? But there's a difference between being big with your words and big with your fists. And I'm going to show you the difference right now. Look at you. The way you smile and give these idiots the approval that you work for. How pathetic. You're a grown man and you let the WWE Universe dictate your life? Let me put it this way, 9 to 5. When you're ready to put the big boy pants on, I'll be waiting. Right here. You're not ready for this, Rollins. Where you're at and where I'm at, if you face me now, you're going to get destroyed. You're going to lose in a way that you can never recover from. And I don't want to do that to you. You don't scare me, 9 to 5. As I look into your eyes, I see a sorry shell of a man. A man who needs love, approval, glittery things to survive. That's a shame. Oh yes, it's a shame. Because one day, these people will forget you, and you'll be left staring back at me. Keep talking, Rollins. That's what you're good at. In fact, that's all you're good at. I've seen your matches. You call yourself a superstar? You're worse off than you look. And dude, you ain't even close to stepping in the ring with me. I have nothing to gain from fighting you 9 to 5. No gold, no treasure, no fortune and glory, nothing. I've got more important things to do, like catch up on my beauty sleep. A real man needs to take care of himself. They are called priorities. And you 9 to 5 are not on my list of priorities. Ladies and gentlemen, what will come of this? And will Mr. 9 to 5 challenge for the world title?